They say God will send mysterious ways, but I can't think of why He would take you away. Trying to deal with the pain, steady praying for strength. Oh. So it's around 6.30 in the morning. And it was like a 40 minute drive here to the clinic. Any surgery, it's in half hour. I have to check in at seven, but it starts till eight. I guess uh, surgery's in the last two hours. So I'm gonna go buy candy at Walker because she's gonna need a Walker after her surgery. And then I'm gonna go get something to eat. And then just wait, just a waiting game. Like a mozada, so like a model. Yeah, right. I'm gonna look. The worst you've ever seen me. in my life. <laughs> so good. I have seven minutes to go inside, but I'm getting so nervous. Oh, shit, diarrhea right now. I feel like my breathing has not been the same since yesterday. I feel like I struggle to breathe. I'm like. <sighs> Anything you slept good neither, huh? No, I didn't sleep good. I'm not hurting you waking up all day. Mm. Yeah. I can't believe I'm doing this. <laughs> Can I just say no? I'm just kidding. Nestor was telling me this morning. He was like, Do you get nervous? And I was like, Hell yeah, I get nervous a day up. He's like, Sometimes I feel like you never get nervous. Or, uh, sometimes I feel like uh, you just do like whatever. Just get there, get it over with, and that's it. Well, I've had so many kids. I've gone through so much. So I'm just like, eh. But you don't look do nervous, it. though. I'm nervous. Like, siento aquí, like, como que I can't breathe. I'm good, though. I'm nervous, but I know everything's going to be fine. Yeah. The nurse is here. Where? So I think I see. You ready to get cut? All right, guys. So it's time to go. Right now you're laughing. I was like, <laughs> this thought I laugh when I'm nervous. I don't cry. I laugh. Let's pray for Kenny, guys. Everything's gonna come out really good. You can't make me cry. I don't wanna go to war. No, que muy chingón. You'll be good, bro. I know. Just managing your pain, the laughter. I'm just scared of the after, the after, the waking up part. I'm like. You got some balls to do this shit, bro. I do. I wouldn't do this shit. And it's only the beginning. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, oh shit, breaks right now. I'm gonna tell the doctor, like I told Juan with my tattoo, just get it over with. Just do it. Just do it. <laughs> <coughs> See you in two hours. You're not gonna it's see crazy, me. Crazy, bro. The last time you see this mujeron, she's gonna be snatched. Snitch. I'll be like, where's Candy at? Say goodbye. <laughs> Tell you. Bro. That's the last time you see it. Are you gonna miss it? Mm, kind of. <laughs> okay, bye. <coughs> um, I miss flipping it. <laughs> <laughs> bye. Bye. There she goes, guys. There she goes. I need a mask. <laughs> they told me I need a mask. That's that the one that smells like chicken perfume. <coughs> Is it? Is this one yours? You mm -hmm. puff like crazy. This one's yours? No, this one smells good. Bye. 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 Okay guys, so I'm all ready. I already have my IV. Let me show you guys. And I'm just waiting for the doctor to come and see me. And I believe he's gonna be marking my stomach and taking pictures and then I'm all ready for surgery. 
Um, I'm not as nervous anymore. I feel a lot better, more calm. Um, they're taking good care of me so far. Thank God they allowed for me to wear socks because my feet always get so cold. So if you guys are getting surgery, make sure you guys bring some socks because it is cold here. All right, guys. So Candy just went inside, and so like I said, guys, I'm gonna go buy her a walker because I guess when she comes out, um, she's gonna be a little hunchback or walking like with her head down. I'm um, sorry, guys. My throat kind of hurts right now. I know it's not COVID. I took a couple tests already. Um, but yeah, guys, I've been drinking like, like a lot of cough medicine, and it just like it doesn't go away. All right, guys. So I ended up getting the the red walker, and I got like a little I don't know what you call those the little sticks for support uh, when she gets up from bed. But I got a good deal on the walker, guys. It was three ninety nine, and the guy hooked it up because uh, it was a display. He's like, don't no no returns or nothing. I'll give it to you for one ninety nine. So I got a good deal, guys. All right, guys. So I got her this right here. The support. Hold it right now, but she can sit here. Has wheels. I think, believe these are brakes when she's walking. Kind of has a little storage right here too. Put your stuff away right there too. Yeah. Enough. I'm talking too much, guys. I'm nervous for Candy. Every time I <sighs> when Candy gets the surgery, whatever, I get nervous because I get anxiety. I have bad, bad anxiety, guys, from living in the hospital when Sebastian was sick. Either if it's for me or for Candy, I get anxiety, guys. So. <laughs> so guys, I have a group chat and Candy just send this to the group chat. I came to this little Chinese spot here in Huntington Beach, California. I was craving some fried rice and some egg soup. I don't know what they call that, but so yeah, guys, um, Candy texted me like around nine in the morning. So it's ten thirty right now. I got some shrimp fried rice. I made it spicy because I love spicy food. And I got the egg soup for my throat. Hey guys, so they just called me right now and it's 11.30 a.m. And they said that everything went well. Thank God. Candy's in the recovery room. They say they're gonna discharge her like in 20 minutes. All right guys, you guys ready to see Candy? They just called me right now and she's, they're coming downstairs. I'm excited to see her guys. She's a whole different woman. Just kidding, I haven't even seen her. <sighs> I'm nervous guys. Uh... She is. Hello. 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 So she will be in a lot of pain and discomfort. Okay. I did give her her pain medication right now. Um, she did say that you guys are staying probably like 30, 35 minutes away from here. Yeah. So as soon as you get in bed, um, get her in bed, um, which is probably going to be like an hour from now, you can give her her muscle relaxer. Okay. 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 Um, right now, I'm going to help you help you put her in the car. Um, by any chance, you guys have like a smaller car bike tomorrow? Um, or like if you can borrow like your friends or. Well, she's going to be staying home. Just... She has to follow up here tomorrow oh, morning. Sure. Yeah. So you think, uh... Tomorrow, when you come, make sure you give them a call upstairs so they can let you uh, borrow a wheelchair. That way, she doesn't have to walk all the way up. Alright guys, so we're heading home right now, um, we got a 30 minute drive, and once we get there, I'll pick up the block. Alright guys, so we're home, this is how Candy looks, okay, <laughs> this is going to be you in 20 years, Candy, actually 40 years. Until Some sopa de fideo. She requested sopa de fideo. <laughs> <laughs> you did, mama? 
and Kenny's still feeling pain, guys. I think she's feeling like a lot of back pain, right? This is the way she needs to be sitting down. Okay. And he's feeling a little nauseous right now. He's trying to get up to use the restroom. Um, yeah. Alright guys, so I'm going to take care of Kenny right now and I'll update you guys tomorrow morning. Uh, to see how she right, guys, it's currently the next day, and we're here for Candy's uh, appointment. First checkup. First checkup, yeah. So, yeah, so how are you Good. Yeah. Better. To the fat of the arm, so you want to clean the area with alcohol. And then you pop off the cap up like this. And then you squeeze the fat and inject down at an angle. One, two, three, tiny poke. Push the syringe all the way down. And then that's it. We keep pushing up and a safety cap comes on and then bring it back to our office. Okay. Okay. Hey, what's up guys? So we're currently back home guys. And let me show you guys what I'm cooking for the girls. It looks legitness. This is my first time doing this guys. Well, I cooked rice before. So I got the rice going on right there. And I made the girls some caldo de pescado or shrimp. This is my first time doing this right here. Let me show you guys. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Guys, I love to cook. It's just a stress reliever for me. Guys, okay, so it's, it's kind of weird because I work out every day at home. Now that we're here at this Airbnb, there's no exercise equipment, so I can't do shit. But I gotta take care of my girl. Tell me how it tastes. It's good? Good. It's my first time making it. It's spicy, there. huh? There you go, guys. That's how it looks. And a side of rice. That's all I've been craving, candles, because I have no appetite. Okay, so it's currently the next day, and I have to give Candy her blood thinner shot. Uh, so it's my first time doing it. And the shot's like this big. <laughs> I'm just playing, it's small. You're scared? Yeah. I'm scared. Jaleek, you want to help me? Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, baby. I'm scared. I'm scared. Look at it. No, hold on. I'm scared. Hold on, not so high. I go to mask. Mm -hmm. Oh, well, I'm scared. Move your fingers on the Hold on. Do it like lower, no? Are you grabbing like right here? Yeah, move your fingers. Oh, that wasn't bad. Yeah. Got it. Oh, faint. Nope. You <laughs> understand myself. Don't do this at home. Damn, I have shaky oh. fingers. I get anxiety. Me dolió. No me dolió cuando me está doliendo. That, so that blood thinner, guys, is for me to not have to get up and walk a couple times a day. Oh, for blood clots. For too. blood clots, so I won't get any blood clots. And if I would have had um, lipo done. I wouldn't have been able to get the blood thinner and I would have to be walking around all day. So that's why the doctor doesn't like to do lipo at the same time as the tummy tuck. So he didn't even want to do my, um, what's it called? Uh, yeah, he told the doctor, was telling me, um, like he didn't want to do anything else with the tummy tuck because it was so hard. And I'm so thankful he didn't do anything else, guys, because... These past two days have been horrible for me, huh? Mm -hmm. I've been having to take extra um, pain meds, and I usually tolerate a lot, and this one, you can just tell, is just by far the worst. Mm -hmm. So I'm very thankful, guys, I didn't do anything else, because he did the muscle repair, and that's what hurts the most. But not only that, my back, oh my god, guys, the back hurts so much, because he pulls the skin down, and then you're like hunchback. So for the past two days, like I've been complaining about the muscle, the muscle area where, where he fixed and my back. I don't feel like I, I feel anything on when me cortó la piel. I don't, I don't feel like pain right there. Too. Yeah, or the drains or none of that. I still have drains. I have drains that I have to be draining every time they get full. Which I'm not draining too much, which is good. Because the doctor doesn't want me draining too much. Remember, I don't have any lipo. So... I am amazed with my results without life for her. They took a big ass piece, huh? Yeah. Almost, yeah. They took a big piece of, of 
what is it called? Skin, skin off. So I'm just amazed of how good it looks already. And I don't even have life bulbs, so that'll come like later on. Life bulb will come in like nine months. And so far, I'm really happy like how my belly button is. And I feel like I'm healing really, really fast. Like I said, it's only been 48 hours. But, and I can't talk too much. The doctor doesn't let me talk a lot. But I'm just talking like softer in that way. I don't put any effort. But I have been avoiding like laughing or anything because everything hurts right now. Everything. Any movement I make, I feel it in my muscles. The first day I vomited and it felt so horrible. But then I just, it just came out and todo me dolía. Just know if you guys are going to get a tummy tuck. I, with my personal experience, everyone's different. I would just recommend doing the tummy tuck alone. I can't imagine having a BBL right now and having to sit on it. It's just, no, there's no way. I Little Candy's doctor and the staff sent her. I always wanted to taste one of these platters. It's just good. And also our friend.